Hi guys, I got the uh, Cold Steel uh, Kukri Machete here and I mean the previous one was the Magnum the Cold Steel SK5 Kukri Gurkha Kukri um, I did polish this one here because Tip Top Shop never got back to me so pretty disappointed with their service but I will just do a chop test and I have the Kershaw here for the comparison as you guys saw in the previous videos this one here is sharp Okay. The cold steel Gurkha Kukri, I mean the uh, Kukri, is sharp. So I'm going to do a quick cut test on this one. Just look down here. Okay. Still not that good. Okay. Not as good as the Magnum. And this is actually sharp. Okay. So this one here, I mean, it is quite, it's pretty bad on the blunt stuff, but you know, it is quite sharp if you know how to cut with it, okay? Decently, it still slices paper, but it does not chop in, okay? It just does not dig in much, okay? So, I mean, this one here can be a really tough workhorse, but uh, you just need to know what this is what you get for about 30, 30 odd dollars, 35 dollars. Okay. Now let's try the Gurkha Kukri the SK5 model. Okay. As I said, I did polish this one. I haven't sharpened it. It's still factory from the box. Okay, let's try this one here. Right. Dug in straight away. Um, not as good as the Kershaw, okay. Okay, this is actually the first chop I ever did. Second chop, pretty similar, okay, very similar. Okay. It does bite in pretty well, um, it's got a really tight bite, but I'm guessing because of the thickness of the blade. Uh, it does take a lot of surface area when it goes in. That's why, probably. I mean, it is very effortless. It is quite sharp. All right. It does do pretty good chopping. All right. Now let's give Kershaw. You guys saw Kershaw here. Straight away. It does have a much bigger bite than the Gurkha Kukri. Okay. Right. The bottom is slightly harder. Alright. So both this one here, you know, roughly about ninety dollars. Okay, this one here is about ninety dollars. Go short camp eighteen. Whereas this one here, the Gurkha Kukri SK five, um, you know, I got it for about two hundred and something, close to three hundred, um, with big discount on it. So this one here does feel better when chopping, okay, but it just does not bite. So yeah, that's my chop test, okay. stay safe and have fun.